Good evening, everybody. Hello. And welcome to Late Night Gav. My name is Gavi, obviously. And, uh, yes, it's, it's, it's been a while, hasn't it, since we've uh, done this whole streaming lark. Um, because illnesses happened again, I had an unfortunate incident with some milk last week. Um, which thankfully didn't entirely derail my weekend, given that it was Mina's birthday weekend, and uh, we didn't want to didn't want to ruin that. But did affect my appetite, which affected the recording plans for Saturday Night Sega, um, given that we couldn't do it live, and also impacted uh, Dragon Ball Z Kakarot stream on Friday, which is also going to impact um, Gav's retro room. But more on that a little bit later on. For the meantime, let's jump back into Resident Evil 2, shall we? I obtained a special costume. I, I did. I don't know if I'm going to be able to show you them. Oh, I can look. Look at this. There he is, Leon in his 1998 pixelated glory yeah. oh, look at that animation so animated bang bang there's also a Claire 98 as well here she is Yep. Anyway. Now we've got those. Let's... Hello, Resident SD. Yeah, I was, uh, I was just, um, was just talking about feeling alright. Uh, I feel much better. Let's say, un basically, unfortunate incident with um, with some milk. Yes, I know. Uh, in fact, what is it? If I can change costume from here. Lol. Um. Um. Yeah, essentially what had happened was I'd, I'd had some uh, breakfast last Thursday morning and in my wisest of ideas, I decided to sort of mix between two cartons of uh, two cartons of milk. One was slightly older than the other one and I believe may have expired a little bit. So I got through Thursday daytime all right, but then got into the evening and didn't really feel like I wanted much to eat. Uh, then woke up Friday morning absolutely terrible. Which was, as I say, it was Mina's birthday, so she was at work. Um, didn't really eat an awful lot Thursday evening, <laughs> Friday evening, rather, but uh, did feel better for a trip into York that we were doing on the Saturday. But obviously, it did impact um, pretty much my entire plans as far as streaming and hosting and, and creating content went um, over the weekend. So. There we are. Right, where are we supposed to be going? Is there a bit? <sighs> Find the three medallions. Ah, yes. This is what we want to be trying to do. Uh, I've got a battery. I've got an... Ah, yes, I've got the... Detonator for a C4 explosive, which is missing a battery. Ah, you see? There will be plenty more content starting now. Indeed, there is. We're going to be doing Resident Evil 4 now. We are going to get... Um... Now then, I need to actually remember... Also, you're going to have to excuse the yawning. For some reason, I have been... I am very, very... Explosive barricade. There we go. So I want to be on the third floor 
on that side. Um, I feel very, very tired. I'm going to do my best to try and hide it. But there's no uh, no guarantees I'm going to do a particularly good job of it. Um, so yeah, so we're doing Resident Evil 2 today, obviously. We're back, back on this. Um... And if I die multiple times, the bonus that we're going to have here is I get to drop the difficulty down to an easier one. Yay! Uh, I want to get up some more stairs. Yes. It's been a long week and it's only Tuesday. I... Certainly know that feeling, yeah. Hang on, am I... Ah! I'm already here. I thought I'd have to go up another flight of stairs, but I'm already where I need to be. That's handy. And... Got some more handgun ammo. Also handy. Right, let's do a boom. And maybe let's not stand next to the thing. Oh, I don't like the sound of that. don't like the sound of that screeching noise that we just heard. Oh boy. Huh? There's a liquor around here somewhere. Oh no, hang on. No, it's a zombie. Son of a bitch. Yeah, we dealt with him. It's fine. It's fine. This has a medallion. But... I don't know how to move these. I'm assuming that somewhere is the uh, the answer to the puzzle. I don't know where though. Like I honestly have no idea where it is I'm supposed to have been looking for the answers to these. Is there a I didn't know if there'd be like a solution that required all of these rusty bits to sort of um, look the same but it doesn't look like it do I have anything in here
Da, 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 da. No. Hmm. And this is probably where we're going to spend a lot of the stream. Is there something on the medallion that... No. I I'm going to cheat. Sorry. <coughs> do, 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 do. I'm just going to find see if I can find out where you get the Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Ah, I already have the solution, look. Lol, I didn't actually realise this had a second page to it. <laughs> there we go, never mind. Right, so the girl is a person, what, a, a bow and arrow and what looks like a snake. Okay then. So that's the person, that's the bow and arrow, there we go. We've got the maiden medallion. Fantastic. Right. Uh. <laughs> Jeez. Best go down a floor and find the, um, the others then, hadn't we? Yeah, I thought so. Oh, you... <sighs> Fucking hell. I knew it. I knew it purely because... The... Right... There's a hole there, and actually, where I expected that liquor to drop from was where the zombie was. But obviously, the zombie was the one that then came wandering through to say hi once we'd blown a hole. Scared the crap out of me, I'll be honest. Right then. Where do we need to go from now? Ah, we can go through the lounge. There's the unicorn statue. And there's a zombie! Oh, you... I think I left him in here last time, didn't I? <sighs> Jesus. Yeah. No such thing as a safe room, is there? No such thing at all.
Anyway, enough about all that. How are you doing, Resident SD? You doing all right? Uh, where are we? Unicorn statue, fish, scorpion, and a bowl. Fish. Scorpion. And a bowl. There's a unicorn medallion. Other than obviously being tired, but I, I completely agree that that does not bode well if it's uh, Jack Dial Lock and the Lion Statue at the top of the stairs. Here's our friend the lion. If I'd been paying attention, we probably could have done some of this last week. Uh, lion is lion, branch, and bird. Okay. Lion. Branch. And bird. Our friend Melvin there looks very dead. Yep. That's number two. And last of all, I don't know what to use the ruby for. I'm going to have a, a quick gander of what the ruby is for. Jeweled box in the interrogation room. How do I get into the interrogation room? There's a question. Okay, well. Let's go have a look. Shall we? Because, you know, what could be worse than... Walking through all this area with loads of people. Uh, that doesn't get me into the interrogation room, so that's no good. Uh Oh, I see. I need a crank. Right, okay. So
Just having a quick look at the uh, and uh, how to actually get into the interrogation room. It's not very helpful. <laughs> so, that doesn't open to get me in that way, although it would only get me so far anyway. The fire escape only brings me so far because, again, I think that's where the helicopter is. Although I actually thought the helicopter was on this... No, it's not on this side. Hmm... Did I put something in the item box that I might want to retrieve? No. No, I did not. This is one of those things where I could probably have it... I'd find it handy having my iPad next to me as well with more information. Though I feel like once I get new keys... Um, I should... Uh, you know, come back. Or that maybe I don't stay in the basement of the police station that long. So let's uh, let's come and have a gander. Looks like it leads underground. Good, we can get out of this hellhole. Hey, Marvin, guess what? I think I found the way out. Marvin, come on, let's get you out of here. Let's go. Are you okay? Oh, no. I... Just go. Save yourself. Come on. It's bad. We gotta get you to hospital Please, now. Please, Claire. We both know how this is going to end. Get out of the city. Yeah, go on, Claire. Get out. Claire. Please. Go. Do this for me. I actually can't remember if you end up seeing uh, Marvin in Resident Evil 3 in the original one. I think okay. where you sort of the the room in which you see him in and then end up killing him Marvin. in because he doesn't wander too far. Thank you. Um, I'm fairly sure Jill then sees him later on. Nope, that definitely looks like we're not going back. Solve the goddess statue puzzle. Okay. There must be a way back in though, because we don't have all the keys. Oh well, I'll... Mm. I don't know. If we can't go back up, we can't go back up, but... Never mind. We have we have escaped the main area. I'm going to put that in there for now. We can always come back to it. So 
So let's go underground. Got 20 points for that achievement anyway, if you just in case you were curious. Oh deep joy. What we really wanted down here was a dark room. Uh, where do we want to go? What's this way? Hello? Hello? Huh? Upper middle. Okay. Oh, we did want to be going that way then. That's fine. I found a hand grenade! Because why not explode a zombie? Special weapons case. Yeah, I know. I don't have... Anything to open it with. So let's go. Can't go that way. Which means our only way is this way. Hello? Ah, it's our little girl friend. Her name is Sherry. It's okay. Won't hurt you, I promise. I'm sorry, I can't understand you. You need help. Why? He's right behind you. What? Oh, oh dear. Oh no. You gotta be kidding me. What is it with Resident Evil bosses and eyes? You know, we had it a couple of weeks ago with Resident Evil 4, lots of eyes, and and now lots of eyes on this one. Love that. Love that. Oh boy. Uh Ah, hello. Yes, I know. Combine. Ah. See, look, massive eye. Why do you have such a big eye?
Oh, he's running faster. Ah, no! Don't. When I see him, he's getting a... Grenade, a flame grenade, straight to his face. Oh. But maybe I don't be so close to him first. No, you need another one. This is not hard to miss now. Alright, one more. Ah! Still alive? Joking. Oh, there we go. Is it though? Are you sure? Yeah. Yeah. Is it though? Promise. <laughs> it's fine. I just need you to <sighs> Will you help me find my mom? Your mom is down here? I think so. I hope so. Yeah, of course, I'll help you. I'll help you. Okay, I'll bring the ladder down then. If if I if I said I you know, if I didn't, if I said I wouldn't help you. Guess you're stuck down here. Well, I'm going to ignore what you said, and I'm going to come this way for some more bits. Because I need bits. I think. Although the only bits I can get are those. Right, okay. Combine with that. Combine with that. And hooray! We've got some things. Oh, green herb. Always handy. Yep, thank you. Is that it? Believe so. Uh, any 
anything else I can grab from here? You got it. It won't move, she says. You have you ever felt like trying to move the lever there? What's your mom like? She works at Umbrella. She's making an important new medicine. Umbrella? That big pharmaceutical company? My mom's always at work. I don't get to see her much. Well, hopefully you'll get to see her again soon. So, where is your dad? He, um, worked with my mom, but he's gone. Wow. Both of my parents are gone. It's just me and my brother. Oh. <gasps> Hip pouch. We can get more items. I'm sorry. Don't be. It means we've got something in common, and... Thing, We're right? safe. Uh, there isn't anything I need to put in there. Although, can I move stuff? Yeah. There. We'll do that just so I know what space I've got left and it's not just things. All over. Right. Okay. Okie dokie dokie. Hope everybody who is watching is having fun right now and is enjoying their week, other than as they resident SD saying that he's feeling very tired. Oh, are we back in the police station? Yeah, we're in the parking lot by the looks of it. Here. I'm gonna say don't help her up. <laughs> Come on. Over She's there. only a little girl, I'm sure she won't. Don't need too much help. It's closed. I'm going to try this door. This door's also closed. Can I loot the police cars? No. Be too easy, wouldn't it, for this to be open? Just be like, ah, here's how we get out. Although, you know, damn it, we need a key card. Everything needs key cards. We need a key card. Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to try and lift it. Yep, still need that key card. And you're sure this is the way? This is how my mom took me last time. Sherry? I've been looking everywhere for you, Sherry. Brave little girl to leave your house in the middle of this mess. On the ground, hands behind your head. You can't be serious. On the ground, now. Now here's a character I don't recognize. Shut up. Tire. Okay then. You tie her up now or she dies. What's this all about? Child endangerment for starters. Sherry. Come here. What are you gonna do to her? None of your fucking business. You hurt her, I swear to God, my brother is stars, and I will fuck her. Sherry, get over here. What's your name? What's your Still don't. name? Claire! Sherry, you come with me now, or say goodbye to Claire. Okay, okay, I'll go. You better be taking me to my mom. Mm. Absolutely. Don't listen to him, he's shit. Stop hurting her, please! How would you know that, Claire? Because you don't even know who this person is.
genuinely cannot remember who that character is. <laughs> Stay safe, Sherry. I'm going to assume. Key card first, then that asshole gets what's coming to him. Um. That's interesting. Picked up an item, but can't examine it. Um, I'm going to assume he was in the in the original version of Resident Evil 2, but like I say, for the life of me, I cannot think of his name. Don't know it. Most characters I know. I know who the boss fight was, but for those who haven't uh, played Resident Evil 2 or its uh, or its remake, I won't spoil. Um, there's a couple of doors we can go through. Let's just have a gander through this one first, though. There's drinks here. You can have a choice of... I don't even know what they say. They're almost AI in... in what is that one? Food. That's my favourite. This one here. It's a shame I can't get into like first person mode and show you it, but it's it is literally look. Foo and then right at the end, Ed. Foo Ed. Ah, there's an elevator controls room over here, so there's not much to go that way. Let's let's have a look around this way first then. That's my that's my absolute favourite thing that I think I'm gonna see on this stream is the fact that there is a drink Must be where that guy came from. That is called Foo Ed. Raccoon Monthly, June issue, blah de blah de blah de blah. Bastard Pick that up. Police chief. And a map. He's the chief of police. Hmm. Okay then. Express elevator to chief's office, not for general use. Fair enough. Oh, I've got three viewers now. Hello, everybody. We were just uh, having a nice little discussion about the... Um, the the drinks in the drinks machine here in the uh, police station parking uh, parking garage because they look like it's what would happen is if you asked an AI image generator such as like you know um, Bing or whatever to to name some drinks for you so we've got um, a a little um, kaumpa maybe and then my personal favourite fuad <laughs> it's brilliant. It's just the fact that it's just got Ed at the end, but the rest of it is this clearly an F. Claire's head's in the way, so I can't get there, but it clearly says Foo Ed. Yep. My favourite of all the cold drinks. I I would like some like them to be to be invented in real life. Is there any in here? No, these are just random buttons. Cold drinks. Yep. Uh, right. Oh, kennel. Hmm. All right, then. We're going to have to kill some... Huh? Why well, I can I can hear the zombies, but I cannot see them. Blue herb. This is for poison. 
That's good. That means... That means the dogs are going to poison me, doesn't it? Okay. Oh. Can I boom headshot it and kill it in one go? I'll take a Fuad Max. Fuad Zero Sugar. Shit. Ah, there's two. Oh, you... Christ. Can they open doors, I wonder? Ugh. Do not want, do not want. Massive, massive, massive amounts of do not want there. Equipment disposal note. Keyless entry buttons. Seven four three nine. Okay. Found a box. That's handy. What's in the box? Don't want to do it. There is something inside. Okay, what's in it? It's a key. And a message from Mr. Raccoon. Yeah. So if we see a Mr. Raccoon toy, we shoot it. You don't to get anything for it past an achievement I don't think but it's certainly something worth looking at and why not walk into the full firing range where there are two of our Beautiful, lovely zombie friends. Oh, and a, and a Mr. Raccoon toy, actually. There it is. For the sake of an achievement... Bang! And... That is very much welcome. Thank you very much. Is there anything else to get in here? No, there isn't. Do you know, I despise how dark these corridors are. <laughs> and now I've got to go back through the kennel. However, I am now armed with a grenade launcher. Oh, where where have they gone? Well, there's one. I was kind of hoping I could kill both of them.
think I did. Boom. There we go. We now have the same issue that we had before in that we've have no we have no grenades. But that has dealt with the liquor problem. Unless we get around here and find that there's a third one. Or we find that that dog comes to life. Which it doesn't look likely. Is this currently searching as if there's something... Is there something in this room then that I can pick up? Because it doesn't look like it. Oh, hang on. Yes, there is. What's that? Ah. I can combine with gunpowder to make acid rounds. That would be for the grenade launcher. I don't have any gunpowder, though. Not at present. Uh, I assume... Can't go this way. No, because I need a crank. Okay. Let's go into the morgue, then. What, on, what other places would anybody clearly want to visit when... Although, actually, hang on. First, we've got the key, haven't we, for a... Um, police car. Let's go explore what that police car is going to give us. I'm actually genuinely surprised we haven't died yet. Because um, I was thinking about changing the difficulty of the game. And then realised that I can't do that until uh, I've died a few times. Right, so I need to find the squad car. And there we are. What's in here? It's a gun! Ooh, itchy ear, hang on. A JMB HP3. Oh wow, holds more 13 shot 9mm handgun. It's got a laser sight. That could come in handy. That could come in extremely handy. That was worth going back for. Okay. Into the morgue then. Because, you know, I say again, in the middle of a zombie apoc apocalypse, where better place to go than, you know, the one room where you put all of your dead people who may or may not be dead.
Yeah. I'll put you back if you don't mind. So actually saying that, I think I do need that one. Sorry, clearly not dead person. But I think I need to examine your body, so... What the fuck? Why are you saying what the fuck for? Like, the person is literally dead. Let's put you back. And let's put you back. Because I'm obviously having to find, like, the right one here. Okay, no one in there. That's fine. No one in there. Also fine. Nice! Nice to see some cockroaches, you know. Red herb. Yep, we'll have that. We'll uh, have a nice little... Right, combine that with that. Yep, and we'll combine that with that. So that will heal me, reduce the amount of damage that I take, and gives me poison resistance. So isn't that nice of it? So that's those three. We just need to check these two then. He has a key. He's also alive. Because of course he is. Oh, hang on, where did you come from? No, oh, you. Get off. Uh. I actually can't remember how to um, use flash grenades. Hang on two seconds. <laughs> ah, yes, there we are. dog going to get up? No, that's alright then. Um. Hmm? Oh, you... Oh. Oh. <laughs> Run away from the hunt, from the liquor. And of course they're awake now.
Got an achievement for that as well. Bon Appetit. Shot the grenade that you fed to an enemy. Yummy, yummy. Oh. Danger, it says. Well, that's what this is for. And I can actually discard that now because I don't need it. Now then, why? Ah, there's a roll of film. Yep, okay. Is that all I need to be in here? Right, that's all I need to do to be in here. And the elevator control room. Okay, yep. That means I'm legging it from the uh, from the liquor again, but not for f not for very far. Ah. Stupid things. I hate liquors. I really do. I didn't like them in the original Resident Evil 2. I hate them even more in this one. Purely because I just don't have any way of shooting it. You know, it's just... Yeah. Shoulder stock. Okay. But I don't think I have the gun for that. No, I don't. Right, that will let me use the elevator. And up we go into the police chief's office. Am I playing this on Xbox as the DBZ sound thing has happened? I guess it's an issue with Microsoft's Twitch implementation. Ah! Well, that's funny, that, because nobody actually picked up on it last week. So, yeah, it probably is Microsoft's Twitch thing. Okay, then. Um, the issue I've got is I'm not near a save point. So, we're probably going to have to just stick with it unfortunately until we get to such a point where I can um, I can save and bring it back out sorry here we are we're in the chief's office now copy of email Hang on, there's a save point here. There we are. Right. Bear with it. Two seconds then. I will uh, exit out and for the last hour or so we'll, uh, we'll pop back in and uh, the sound issues will be fixed. Here we go then. Let's see how we uh, how we go now.
this should this should fix it. While I'm waiting for the game to say to load, though, oh look, we've unlocked some unlockables. I'm gonna have a drink. Okay then. We are back. And item box. I'm going to store. Although actually. I oh know it's got. It's got bullets in that I can't take out. So never mind. We'll store that because I don't need two guns. Taxidermy log. Yeah. Wolf. Other things. Deer. Okay, so submachine gun ammo. Is there really? Oh yeah, so there is. I haven't got a submachine gun, but I'll take the ammo, because I feel like I'm probably not gonna be too far away from one. Ah, I see. Right, okay. Come through here then. And we are now in the private collection room. Which I see. Yep. I can't get into because there's a puzzle. That looks like a dodo. And we've got the heart-shaped key. And we need to find the parts for the power panel. Okay. Awesome sauce. Right, let's see what zombies have been hidden. Oh no, okay. Behind this door. Oh look, there's another Mr. Raccoon. There is an achievement for shooting all of them. I don't know whether I will or not. I mean, that has made... I don't know, because it doesn't... Uh, tell you. It just says destroy all Mr. Raccoons. But it doesn't actually log how many you've got. <laughs> right, so I could head towards the roof. But actually what we're going to do is we're going to come down here. And we are going to panic. Because panicking is what I absolutely adore, to, uh, adore doing. But now we're in the interrogation room. And yet we'll have those. And... That 
is that goes in there. And that gives us a stars badge, which as I have already found out, we have a gander at it. And it turns into a USB key. And there's gonna be something that comes out of that wind that comes out oh that's pretty cool. Okay. Goodbye. Uh-huh. Uh, I can't go into the observation room because I do not... Nope, I don't have the spade key. So that's good to know. Hang on. The liquor's trying to get me... Ah, jeez. I was about to say the liquor's trying to get me through the... No zombie, no. Quick get upstairs. As far as I'm aware, zombies are not capable of climbing stairs in this game. Have I still? Yeah, I do. That's fine. I've still got some health bits. Which are absolutely helping me to survive at the minute. Uh, right, we've got two doors. One takes us out onto the balcony, the other one into the storage room. Let's go balcony first then. Because really, you know, what could possibly go wrong here? There's a herb that I can't pick up. Yep, that's fine. And that... Okay, that takes us down onto the roof. Right, well, we'll come back to that. We're having a lot of fun... We're not having a lot of fun. Where did you even come from? That you could just... Uh. Oh, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to keep that. Zombies can climb upstairs. I didn't think they could. Well. more you know. Okay, so. 
We know there's a blue herb. Some acid rounds. Which I absolutely am going to get one of them equipped. And that. Heart door. Let's get that open. What's in here? Uh huh. What is that? A combat knife. All right. Let's um. There, I have a knife now. And a boxed electronic part. Ah, right. Yes. We do also need that. Can I open it? I wonder. An Aegis Cube Conductor. There we go. Ooh, crank. Large gear. Oh, wow. Okay. I can't put that anywhere. Not in my inventory anyway. <laughs> and that door's locked. Okay. Right. So let us uh, start to make a bit of sense about where we're going. No zombies out on the roof, you know, figuring that they'll uh, keep themselves nice and wet. Oh, hang on. There's a door I can go through. Whoop, whoop. I mean, nowhere I can go from it, but it's, it's good to know that there's a door. I've, I've, en I've entered the door. Let's potter down here then. Oh, hello. Can't go anywhere here except a break room. Son of a bitch. I can do this. There's no another zombie. Don't actually know what that's done. I'm guessing Well, I don't know. <laughs> done something with the boiler. <laughs> oh, hang on. Ah, da ha ha. Is that what I've done? Oh, hello. Jesus, stay back. Uh, 
What the ever living. He can't climb ladders, can he? Yes, he can. Oh, my. Um. I shot his hat off, by the way. I got an achievement for it. Right, can he come into the chief's office? I didn't think he was allowed in save rooms. Anyway, while I'm here... <laughs> What I also don't like is the fact that you can hear him stomping around. That's just, oh. Right, this has got four points on it. Oh, there we go, okay. So like, I don't know where he is. Oh, he's still here. How? Seriously, is he running after me? No. That's it, Claire, you know. Um... Where do I want to go? Hang on a minute. I need to I need to figure this out. I want to get to the Well, I want to get to the main hall. Okay. Because the main hall, I'll be safe in there. Where's the quickest way there? Right, okay. I can do that. Yeah. There. Main hall. Can't get me here. Oh God, no, Marvin. Marvin's a zombie now. 
can't shoot him. Well, I can shoot him, but I just can't aim for him. Hang on! You're not meant to be allowed in save rooms. That is absolutely not fair. Oh. There's a liquor. Third floor locker is DCM. Okay. This is genuinely terrifying. Like, you can't really stop. <laughs> you know? Where does... Actually, where, where do these stairs take me? They... Don't take me into the library... It is going to be one of those now that every time I see a save... Oh. Oh, it is up here. Okay. Yep. And then there's a locker on this floor that we can open with D C M. Okay. Now then, I need to get to the clock tower. Uh, <laughs> which means I need that gear. I'm going to say something, and I don't want to sound stupid when I say it, but I hope this hasn't got any sort of implement implementation in it similar to um, ah, Star's Office. Actually, yeah, Star's Office. Um, similar to Aliens Isolation. Sorry, I'm going. I will get my words out. Where the more you talk, the more like Mr. X knows where you are.
There, we're in here. Whoop whoop. Letter to members. This does not sound like Chris. Right, where can we go now? Diamond door. Or do I have a... I do have the diamond key, actually. Let's go through the diamond door around here, see what's around there. In the linen room. Oh, and now we're done with that key, we can get rid of it. What is in here? A portable safe. Okay. Well, we can... We can spend some time trying to open this. Okay. Right, so... Oh, that one. That one. That one. Oh no, hang on. Right, that, that, that. Mm. No. No. It's there. Right, okay. So. What are we doing? What am I even doing? There we go. And it gives us a nice little commemorative tune. And we get a spare part. Yeah. That we can use in the weapons locker. If we can get to the weapons locker. And there's some gunpowder, which I can't combine anywhere. Because I've still got a shoulder stock, which I just don't have. Any uh, ability to use. Mm. I wish we could just lock him in a room somewhere, you know, it'd be like, no, don't want you, go away. Uh, right, where am I going? Oh, I want the, yeah, that's it, safety deposit 
room, so I want first floor. How do you run so quickly? Like seriously, just go away. Two oh three. Two oh three. Yay, more space. Um Two oh eight is another one we can use. Although we could have done that before, so I don't know why we haven't done that before. Maybe because we didn't actually have um, the grenade launcher at the time. Also, it looks like Mr. X won't come in here. One oh three. I don't want to jinx it though, now I've said that out loud. I probably have jinxed it saying that out loud. Kind of wish I hadn't said it out loud. Is that it? Is that all of the... Yeah, that's all the lockers open. Okay, then. I want to go into this room. Because then I can get into this room. And then I don't need that key anymore. Oh dear, I'm going to die. Oh no, I can stab him. Also, absolutely was not expecting him to, to follow me in here for some reason. Don't know why. I was kind of hoping he'd allow me the opportunity to uh, have a bit of an explore, but apparently not. But that's fine. Right, where am I going? I'm going operations room for some reason. Um, that's fine. Oh boy. I've lost that knife, but it's perfectly fine. Don't want it back. Don't want any of it back. Goodbye, 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 goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye. Right, I'm going to actually... Options. Yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. Audio... Uh, 
Uh huh. Uh huh. Right. Okay. Yeah. No. Okay, then that's fine. That's the one thing I wanted to know was could the uh, could the tyrant hear me while I'm talking on stream? And the answer to that is a resounding absolutely no. Uh, no, I don't want to go that way. I want to be in the library, which means I need to be upper floor. Okay. Right, so... Ah, right, I see. Okay. So I can't. Yeah. Uh-huh. And then, does that one roll? Right. I was hoping I could kind of just jump across and then Mr. X or Tyrant or whatever you want to call him, he wouldn't be able to follow me, but nope. No such luck on that. But hey, at least he won't be up here. And also, apparently now all the lights are off. <sighs> oh, you... Get off. tower. What I was going to do was uh, come around this side. And unlock this door. Repair plan. Da, 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 da. Yep. Oh, I needed to unlock that door anyway. How did you get back up? Oh boy. 
He's in the way. Right, where is that? There it is. Get out. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Oh, of course he's still following me. Jesus. Why? Oh, hang on, he doesn't come in the clock tower. Okay. That's alright then. I feel somewhat safe knowing that he won't come in here. <laughs> Small gear. Yep, I'll have that. Because I don't actually know how I would evade him if he was to come in here. So, with that turning, what is it turning? Do I need to pick another gear up? Am I... Yes, I do. Okay. So I needed to use the gear to drop the stairs, then pick the gear back up again to, uh, I'm guessing, put it up here, which is going to make that turn. Yeah, there we go. That works. It did. I'm as surprised as you are, Claire. Although we're going to pick this item up and then we've got to fight our way around past our good friend, Mr. X, and the. and probably some liquors again. Alright, let's open this. There it is. And let's plan our route. 
East storage room. Oh, actually, no. I could. I suppose we could just go through the east storage room and get down. Uh, get down the stairs, and then into the chief's office. Yeah. Okay. Although. Oh no, I can still hear him. I was going to say, although I think the tyrant's gone, but he hasn't. Because of course he hasn't. Why would this game make our life easier? But it's fine. It's fine. It's all good. There we go. Oh, hello. Right, now we've got a puzzle. Ah, I see. Yep. Uh -huh. There we go. <laughs> Phone's ringing. Go on, Claire, pick it up. Because, you know, why not? Could be important. Hello. Hello. Good to see you again, Claire. We've got unfinished business. What's that? Oh. You'll find it. Sherry, all right? For now. I swear, you bastard, if you hurt her. Stupid. Just hadn't dropped that fucking thing I could bloody PPI. I know. Don't worry, Sherry. It'll be all over soon. There's an achievement here, which I know in the achievement list for getting out of this bedroom in sixty seconds. That absolutely is not going to happen because I don't even know where I'm going. Wow. You're not scary at all. Yeah, so I need... A block. Okay, yep. Oh, hello. Right, okay. Yep. Uh huh. It needs to be a star on that. So oh boy. Right. Okay. I can. I can see why this. You can't do this in sixty seconds. Unless you absolutely know what you're doing. That's fine. Uh. Hmm. Well, that has to be in the right place there. That's not the right place. That there. Oh, there we go. Awesome. Yep. Have that. Got some scissors. Yep. And then... Some scissors on those. And we're out. 
I think we're out anyway. I feel like I actually could have done that in less than 60 seconds if uh, that puzzle wasn't so hard. Sally's diary, blah blah blah. Also, I don't think Shelley has a safe point. Doesn't seem like it anyway. Does the police chief here, do you reckon, does he... I don't have the key for the door out of here. Yeah, darn it. Gosh darn it. director's room. Oh, hang on. There is a safe point. If you're reaping this, go call Khalees. Boogeyman's here, eating every boby. Many bark boogeyman's here. Help, they're coming. Help me, mummy. Oh. That's, uh, kind. Sherry, I told you to stay put. You need to learn to listen. Leave me alone. Mm. Just please. Time to teach some manners. Uh. Ah! Ah! You little bitch. You're gonna pay for this. Ah, you little shit. You hear? The, the problem you've got here is, Sherry, is um, we still don't have the key. Oh, lovely. Doors locked. Where are you? Show yourself. I know you're in here. The longer it takes me to find you, the worse it's going to be.
switch has got to be here somewhere. God damn it! Game over, Sherry. Uh, no! Oh. You are trapped. Well, that was worth. Uh, that was fun. Oh, I can change game mode. Switch to assisted game mode and continue. Yes. I know we're sort of overrunning the two hours a bit, but I want to get to the next save point because I, uh, don't actually know how long this segment is. good police chief, is he, really, when you think about it? <sighs> right. So now he's let me out. go that way. I'll go that way. Can't go that way. Oh dear. Oh, oh, it burns. oh, there we go. Look, we can get the key. Of course he's got an axe. Where did he get the axe from? There we go. Look, we've got a cutscene now. There we are. We're, we're safe.
Lovely. <laughs> 30 minutes earlier? What are you talking about? Don't waste my fucking time! Bring me the pendant or Sherry dies. Pendant? What do you need it for? Do you want the girl to die? Fine. Where are you? The orphanage. The orphanage? Where is that? that? In the neighborhood. You'll find it. Is Sherry alright? Right. For now. I swear you bastard, if you hurt her. her. Mm. He's such a good police chief. Damn it. You yeah. know, serve and protect. Anyway, we've got the parking garage key card. Just Out of nowhere. Magic. Mm. Hide and seek. We've got an achievement there. Complete Sherry's segment. Yes, we did. And we're going to save the game and then that's where we will leave it. Although we are now in assisted mode because we actually technically died by being caught by the police chief. So that should mean that zombies take uh, less hits to die. Mr. X probably won't chase us with such um, force, <laughs> I suppose. I can't I can't think of another way of, wor of wording it. I'm actually going to store that as well, because we don't have that gun. So... Oh no, we do have that gun! I have been completely forgetting. There. Takes more space up. But now... Way. Okay. Has that put us in assisted mode? It has indeedy. Okay. That's it then. We will leave that there for today. So that was uh, Resident Evil 2. Thanks for thanks for being in as well, SD. I think you're the, literally the only person who's watched this entire stream. <laughs> Thank you for your company. It's been fun. Um, yeah, maybe Resident Evil 2 isn't grabbing people's attention. But hey, I'm having fun, and that's the main thing. So on Friday, we're going to be back to... Uh, to um, Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. Uh, well, probably because obviously I didn't stream last Friday, and I would like to try and get Dragon Ball Z done before my summer break for Friday streams. We're probably going to hit Super Mario Galaxy 2 on the head and uh, come back to that as the first Retro Room episode in September. Um, I was briefly worried because I'm having a change of uh, working hours um, at work, what with a change of job role. I was worried that the Friday streams may no longer be able to continue. However, um, my day off during the week hasn't changed so uh, I will still be off on Fridays we will still be able to do our Friday streams as per usual SD won't be around I'm at a company away day oh well have fun hope the weather's nice for it I know it's been a bit iffy this week so if you are outdoors for whatever reason um, then uh, then then you know hope you uh, hope you have fun and it is good news I didn't really want to change it to another day in the week so being able to keep it to Fridays is good but also, I get every other weekend off, which means that every other weekend, I'm on a three-day weekend. Rather than having it once in four weeks, I've now got it once every other. So that's good. Um, so yeah, so we're going to try and get Dragon Ball Z Kakarot done before uh, the summer, my summer break. But, you know, the Tuesday streams will still be going on during the summer, so that's also good. Um, and then, uh, and then yeah, we'll do, we'll do Mario Galaxy 2. Uh, as a retro room episode when we come back and there should be a saturday night sega this week as well it will be pre-recorded because uh, i'm out i think um going out drinking for, with some friends so it will be pre-recorded i don't know whether it's going to be a club sonic dj set or if it'll just be me babbling for people to listen to but either way 
we'll do a stream. Uh, we'll we'll do a show. It's been it's been a couple of weeks. Best get one out. Otherwise, people on Radio Sega might forget what my voice sounds like. Anywho's, thank you for watching. Um, I'll be back next week on Late Night Gav for some more Resident Evil 2. But uh, before that, it'll be DBZ Kakarot. Ta-ta!